Welcome back, everybody. This is the Reflection of Love Weekend 3, Day 2. And I have with me somebody who has been just so ingrained in the Reflection of Love since it began, what, three weeks ago. Lost Frequencies. Hey, what's up? Congratulations for being alive. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm happy to be here today. I don't understand how you have managed to do everything you've done. You tell everybody listening at home what Weekend 1 was like for you because you were everywhere. Tell us, tell us. Weekend 1. Uh, weekend 1 was super fun because it was the first time we did the live show on the main stage. It was very stressful. Uh, I remember being uh, super scared. Like I was standing there with my guitar and I was like, why are we doing this? <laughs> but uh, then it, it, it ended up to be super nice. But the week before that, before the live show on the main stage, we went to Norway. Then on the same day, France, Spain, and then we went back to Finland, and then we went back to Spain. Then we went, came here for Tomorrowland to do the live show. And then the week after, I went to, uh, to Ibiza. And then I came back for Tomorrowland, Lost Frequencies and Friends and, uh, on the main stage. And then I, I went to Spain. Now I just came back from Saudi Arabia and Macedonia. And today we're playing Lost Frequencies and Friends and tomorrow on the main stage. Round of applause, everybody, because, <laughs> like I said, I, I have no idea how you've managed to, to still be standing here on Weekend 3. And, let it be let it be said right now you are so massive around the world right now tomorrowland decided you to they said we're going to adapt the main stage especially for your live show that is correct right yes it's really crazy what we managed to do with tomorrowland hand in hand uh, they really created a whole space for us uh, under the main stage we actually did a whole live on Instagram right before we went on stage so you can follow us it's it's on the it's on the feed you can find it so we, we go from the backstage throughout like all the way to the stage we go under the main stage we they, they open everything up because we go from under the stage on the stage like with the drummer the the guitarist and the keyboard player the singers like everybody we come up from underground and then we do the show from there and uh, it's something that was never done before with Tomorrowland so uh, it was it was not easy but uh, I'm happy we managed to do it and uh, yeah, it's something different and I hope people here uh, enjoy the effort. <laughs> Another round of applause for the amount of effort that it took to do that. Can we just try and replicate it now? Can you just bend down? And so it, this, is like, this is what happens on Last Frequencies Live Show. Bend down with me. And this is the main stage and then up it comes. And then like, got the keyboard. That was basically what happens on the main stage. <laughs> yes, yeah, that was it. I was super scared. You, see, you can see the video. I was like... Uh, but it, it was fun. So the first time that happened and you came, because it, it doesn't sound like you had a, that much of a chance to practice or rehearse this happening. Did that happen no. or not? We, we did a one hour sun check on the right. morning itself. Uh, but it's very different to, to do it in front of all the people and alone. Also because we didn't go through the whole show, like we just did, we did the intro, the outro and somewhere in the middle to see everything. Also because uh, everything has to work. Yeah, I mean, we, mechanically as well. Right? Usually we do this show on the crossover festival and we have like a one hour changeover. Here we have five minutes, so <laughs> we don't have a line check, we don't have a audio check. We just go for it and hopefully everything works. So describe to me, when you first came out and you saw the audience and the people of tomorrow all in front of you for that very how did what was that describe how you felt i thought uh why am i doing this why didn't i just take my usb and <laughs> play the dj set and why do i make my life complicated but um after one, after 15 minutes i think also for the people it was they had to check a minute what was what was going on because it, it, it never happened before so it was kind of a special moment, but then once the music went through and, and Kai, the singer, came on stage, like the music came, came over to the people and it, it was a great party. It was amazing. It was such an amazing live performance. And, it's, and you can tell the amount of effort that's gone into it. So super, super great. Thank you. <laughs> and for so many times. And that isn't the only thing you're doing because you're also hosting like one of the biggest stages at Tomorrowland with your friends. Yes. So again, talk to us about that. How have you chosen, uh, like you've just said, right, I'm having a party. Would you like to come? Thanks a lot. I'll see you next guy you can close Those today. guys. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> All the guys you can see on the Lost Frequencies and Friends are people I would 100% have at a party play for me. All right. Uh, for example, last week we had Dom Dola, we had Eric Acres, we had my little brother playing also. Yes. <laughs> he was opening the stage. Uh, we had Pretty Pink, which is also a DJ Amazing. from Germany. And today we have Joel Curry playing, Net Sky. Uh, we have uh, Duck Sauce, Duck Sauce as well. playing Amazing. also. Yeah. Come on, A Track and Arm Van Helden. Um, yeah. <laughs> also, Noisy just came by. Noisy, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, this is just like your, your, your dream lineup, and it's like, right, 100%. come on, let's play. Yes. Um, if, if you got, yeah, you've got your own little slot on that. Like, yes, me too. <laughs> are you looking forward to just DJing? Yeah, hundred yeah. percent. And actually, last week I took it a little bit too I, too lightheaded. Like I arrived and I just went for it, swing it, and I was like, shit, maybe I should have prepared a little bit for it because 
I thought you know I was gonna come, relax, play my DJ sets. Oh, oh sorry. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. I was gonna come, relax, play my DJ sets, but then uh, I was like, maybe next time I should prepare a little bit more because I played all my tracks very late in the sets, and so today I'm a little bit more prepared. So. But I, I heard a little bit of that set, and you were playing loads of tracks that I didn't expect you to play. So that was kind of not in, in the nicest way. I'm like, oh look, you've you know, yes. I, it's interesting to know what you like as well outside of your own world. Yeah, that's why because I played the main stage before yeah. the day before, and I play only my music. So I thought. People that come for the whole weekend, I want to do something different. Uh, so that's what I did. But today I'm going to do a little bit more as frequencies music though. Awesome. Well, it's your stage. It's weekend three. You can do what you like. You've earned the right to do that, all right? Uh, thank um, you. There are so many more questions I want to ask. But right now, um, we should probably go back to the main stage. You've got loads of people here that just want to make some noise for you. We've got to give you some solo vida as well. And you need to enjoy yourself because it's time. It's weekend three, the reflection. I am going to enjoy it because I, I was waiting for this weekend to uh, Get drunk. <laughs> <laughs> to party properly. To party. Come on. All right, everybody, make some noise. Lost frequencies in the place. Come on, come on. Thank you. Mate, enjoy. We'll catch you in a minute. Right now, we go back to that main stage, which is where we find Lucas and Steve.